So yeah, a free Ji Wu. Can't go wrong with that. So obviously, make sure you are doing your gates, your missions, your dungeons, getting all the coins ready to trade it in for a Ji Wu. Whether you don't have a Ji Wu or you have her, and you can really invest into getting dupes for her. And then of course we do get um, two times of a weapon, which is again really fantastic. Um, if you guys want to cater again, as I've said before, into the crit side of her, go for it. Why not? <laughs> it does really also cater to the weapon itself, doing more crit damage. That's fantastic. Um, so the fact that she is a free unit, I think it's time on giving her the new artifact that in my eyes is kind of built for her. That is right. So, this is the current situation uh, that I've got right now. I, I will say I don't typically run the solid analysis set onto her. I typically go with the toughness set so that way I can, you know, make get, get more damage from her in terms of the critical hit damage increase. But uh, with the workshop of Brilliant Light, uh, Jiwoo does play a big, big role in terms of uh, breaking. And so that's hence why I kind of decided to furthermore push for the Sonnet analysis. I should also say uh, that obviously getting a Frigian Wu also is going to help out to those that are maybe in need of some breakage. I mean, let me say, well, to be fair, if your NAM isn't providing as well, then you know, having this Frigian Wu does help out in the breakage department. So, but like I said, as much as break is good, we got to turn up the heat just a tad bit and get more crit damage going alrighty so this is what I'm going to be okay, doing we have got the check, check. greed set obviously with the greed set um, when the user hits a target with an attack that deals break damage it applies the greed effect which basically because I've got a force set on increase the users and team members critical hit rate by 10% and critical hit damage by 15% um, now unfortunately I am unavailable to run an 8 set because I don't have any earring pieces yet we're hoping that we can pull some but either way um what i would actually prefer to do is i would have actually preferred to keep the break analysis set on and then have the greed uh set on the accessory side so that way i've got the breakage power and on top of that i'm still catering to jiwoo on providing her with the crit as well as providing the team, or aka Alicia with the main DPS, giving her some crit um, buffs too. That's what I was really hoping to do, but again, I was very unlucky on um, trying to get um, any earrings. But it's fine, we're going to work with what okay, we've got, no and uh, we've got a decent yeah. set right now. So, we're going to make it work, and uh, if anything, this set is made for her. Because you've got to keep in mind, the only way you can get the greed buff applied is you have to apply an attack that deals break damage if you have a skill that's not applying break damage it is pointless of running this so basically emma and juhu are going to be eating this set alive because everything they do has break on it everything wait does does you not has you got break yeah okay so practically <laughs> every single breaker oh my god uh, lim doesn't have all breakage covers does he oh he does beautiful either way it's going to be breakage covering. Now, the reason why I say it's going to be beneficial more for Jiwu over, over the other breakers, I guess, is, get, is again, because of the consistency of how you can just use her skills one after another. So you're kind of like popping off and gaining the buff um, from the artifacts. So, yeah, we are going to be rocking with this, getting the 15% crit damage buff to Alicia. I'm sticking with the mailing gear set so she's going to be giving me the increased damage of 10 percent and i've got some crazy buffs you guys will see what I, what, what i've got cooking all right so uh these are the blessings that i've had 18 percent crit damage 12 percent 12 percent yeah i'm fully catering to the crit support so uh yeah so everything is in place i just realized though that both mailing and uh jiru are at 106 so, not quite at the 400k mark for the whole team, but we'll get there once we get the new artifacts rolling in. FYI, both Malin's and Jiwoo's artifacts are still at level 15. Oh no, Malin's at 14 uh, and Jiwoo's at 15, so I haven't really fully leveled them up yet. So, I probably will be at 400k if I level them all up, but anyway. Let's do this. One shot, one dream. Let's see what we got. 
So pretty much, I'm just going to keep the same strategy. I'm going to be completely honest. Once, now that I've figured out the strategy on actually how to um, fight against uh, this boss right here. And on top of that, if I see the health bar dropping down by a considerable amount to when he uh, goes into the next phase, it kind of gives me like an indication of, like beforehand on whether or not if I have enough time to actually uh, beat him in the final phase. Like more than enough time to actually kill him off. So, yeah, I've kind of got this fight to a T now. That being said, I'm not looking forward to hard mode. That I'm probably not going to be able to do. <laughs> no way near. I'm j I mean, I'm just barely making out this goddamn fight. But, um, yeah, pretty much just get Alicia in. And do you, but yeah, you go for the instant freeze and then you go straight into uh, Jiwu right here. So, yeah, this is... So, I, I can see that the damage has dropped off a tad bit, but that's that's not... Point. I should also mention, if you didn't see um, when I was showing the blessing, uh, let me go to um, I do have the legendary break effectiveness. If I didn't have that break break effectiveness, that 10.5%, I think I would probably have a hard time of actually breaking him a lot quicker. And having that gear set on would actually not help me out. I, I think the solid analysis does help me out tremendously in terms of uh, helping me out in the breach department. Um, so, yeah, that, that break effectiveness actually really did come in handy. So if you can actually try and get that blessing, then you are going to be chilling. And you can really cater to uh, uh, putting Jiwu with that greed uh, artifact if you have it, of course. So again, pushing more support for the um, DPS. Well, I'm already seeing some good damage, some high amount of damage. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, here we go. So we're not doing too bad right now. I need to focus up because I, I, I know if I get carried away talking, I do lose. I, I, bro, I can't even. I can't talk and play that. <laughs> That's the issue. But I've got to concentrate now. Okay. So game plan here is I'm gonna let him grow a little bit, and then um, we'll freeze him, and then Jiggle will just come in. That's another thing which uh, is very well. You got to be um, wary of is the MP consumption of Alicia, because again, she is the main DPS. This is how this team works. It's kind of risky. Now that my Jiwu isn't doesn't have that much power in her now, because of course I, I, I switched out her gear set and it's again pushing more for Alicia. If we can really have a breakage character that provides um, uh, more MP regeneration, that is going to be uh, a crazy breakage character to have. I think that is kind of like the dream what I want next. To be honest, I'll go crazy for that type of character. Yeah. Da -da 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 -da. Well, where's he going? Hello? <laughs> what the frick? What happened? <laughs> um, I am recording this, right? Oh my god, what the hell? Okay, uh, focus, Shiny. What just happened? <laughs> oh god, okay, yeah, no, we ain't, we, ain't, we ain't messing up right now. Okay, we are doing really good, right? I could possibly. Come on, okay. Damn it. Okay, it's fine. I saw his health bar getting down to that 60 mark, so I was trying to get a little bit more damage off, but it's fine. Two minutes on the clock. Yeah, we're doing very good for time right now. Get touches. Dun, 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 dun. Nice. All right, we've got ultimates at the ready. Shadow is done in 10 seconds. All right, I guess my best bet is just to go in. And then, um... Wait, is my Malian's ultimate at the ready? Let's have a look. Come on. Okay, now, now I need to focus on my Malian. This is nearly ready. Come on, Maylin, come on. Why didn't it let me use my ult, bro? Oh my god, come on. I mean, this is... What? A lot better. Okay. Alright, let's see how much damage this does. Come on, we've got all this crit damage support. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, okay, 10 bars, 10 bars, 11. Oh, okay, maybe more. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That was a lot of bars being ripped apart. That's actually not too bad. Okay. No. Uh, Alicia. Wait, what's the uh, MP consumption? Okay, we've got, we've got a lot of MP now. Okay, we can go in. Oh, we're doing good. We've got ultimate in 20 seconds. Right, I need... Oh, God. I need Mei Lin to be at... Oh, no! Oh, my God. My MP's running pretty low. 20 seconds to the ultimate. Oh! Uh, okay, I need... Jesus Christ. Oh, 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 come on, why is my ult working? Come on, come on, come on, drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it. Oh, that was 
big. That was big. He's running away from me. Okay, alt here. And then this should be enough for Elysia. I am kind of scuffing up here, but it's fine. We've got, we got, we got more than enough time. Da -da, move up the way. And there we go. Butimus. That, you know what? Only on the second try. Not too bad. What the frick? That went a lot more smoother than before. Only two Dead. attempts required. And on the first attempt, if I didn't scuff up my Alicia, I would have done it. Oh, baby. Oh, what we got? Eh. Oh. Um, terrible main stat, but whatever. Um, HP damage increase. That's not too bad. Um, additional defense. That's kind of mid. Uh, uh that's okay. Damn, <laughs> all these legendary artifacts, and all except one or maybe two, and the rest are kind of mid mid. Oh, God. Alrighty, well, yeah, that worked out beautifully. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, everyone getting a copy of Jiwu, again, that's going to help you out tremendously for breakage. Um, yeah, that, that gear set, I, I'm, I'm going to be completely honest, that greed gear set for um, Jiwu and Yonho are going to be insane, because you've got to keep in mind. Cheyenne and Alicia, they are going to be eating that uh, with that um, crit damage buff. So yeah, I would say these two are going to be kind of, I mean even Lim too, because again, Beast can, can also work from it. Again, I'm just really considering the main DPS characters that are going to be benefiting from the crit damage. And so with the breakers on hand, um, eh, specifically with these two, yeah, th this gear set is going to be cracked for it. That being said, I probably would push it for the greed set to be where the accessory sets in, so that way it opens up more for the main set for themselves. Um, unless you want to have the greed set here and then the connection set on the um, other side. I mean, you can also effectively put on the um, uh, blessing set that Meilin has too, <laughs> so that way you can get the extra... 10% but I think it, it will be best to get the connection set going so that way you get the plus 28% um, increased attack so but that's if you really want to fully cater to um, your main DPS characters but okay, yeah running mistakes. running the greed set running an 8 set on the greed set that 30% oh that's gonna be nice that's gonna be nice